All right, thank you, Howard. Well, nursing home employees, including the largest health care union in the county, are picketing over stalled contract negotiations. News 12's Karen Hua brings us a look from the rallies in Yonkers and Austin today. Karen. Well, Ian Gianna, this afternoon I was standing next to a few dozen people who for the past 18 months have been hailed health care heroes. But when it comes to actually paying them for that, they say they don't feel like heroes anymore. What do you want? Contract! I don't hear you! Contract! It's pretty clear what these picketers want. We will strike if we have to. No pay, no work. But it's more than just about money for them. When you come here every day and you see the same patients every day, it's just like, you know, family. Arshma Middleton has worked at Yonkers Gardens Nursing Home for 25 years. But at home, her real family, she has three kids of her own. The cost of living went up, you know, just, just be fair to us. That's all we're asking for. The 1199 United Healthcare Workers Union is calling for three things. A 3% pay raise, $3,000 in hazard pay for working through COVID, and adequate staffing. We have been working overtime, we've been working under staff. Normally, we don't have enough staff to cover the floors. Members today voted that they will strike if their employer does not agree to their terms. It's a stark difference from how medical workers were treated at the start of COVID. During the pandemic, we were called healthcare heroes. From zero to zero. Over in Austin, other union members also rallying for the same. If they was to even come on the floor, you know, just to look around, to know the residents, to see how we work and see what we do, they wouldn't treat us like that. And it's, it's really, really, really sad because we really, really work hard. So, Karen, now that the union members voted that they would strike, what happens now? Well, 1199 is meeting with their employer actually tomorrow to negotiate. And the union tells us usually when they threaten to strike like this, an agreement is ultimately reached. So they're hopeful for tomorrow. The union has not actually held a strike since 1989. We reached out to Yonkers Gardens for comment, but we haven't heard back from them yet. And we also reached out to Cedar Manor Nursing Home in Austin, where they were picketing there. And we're still waiting for a response as well. Back to you. All right, Karen, thank you.